Now there's only three letters left. You have to guess the name soon. They say whoever's first to complete the name will earn an extraordinary balance. Seriously? Then I have a chance to become rich. Okay, now I have to guess. Can you get out of the way? Oh, sorry, you dropped your book. Liam? That's not my name, it's my sister's name. Give me back my book. Okay. You know that boy I bumped into earlier? Do you know who he is? Oh yeah, he's the biggest nerd in school. He spends all his time studying. Well, he dropped his book and it said Liam on it. Book? Oh, he tells everyone it's his sister's name. I think he's lying. Okay, class, for this exercise, you have to tell me your favorite letter. My favorite letter is M. Yes, so the fourth letter of the prince's name is M. I need to finish this soon. K. It's wrong. Be careful, young lady. If you get it wrong again, something bad will happen to you. Something bad will happen to me, but I need to know the prince's name. No, you don't, because he already goes to your school. He goes to my school? <gasps> okay, I'm Amara, Amara! I've called you a hundred times and you didn't hear me. I'm tired of calling oh, you. Oh, sorry, I didn't hear you, Mom. I need to get your hearing sharpened. Huh? Guys, my sense of hearing is getting sharpened, so you can't whisper around me anymore. What? Seriously? Yes, it was my mom's choice. Does that mean your ears will change too? Change? What do you mean? Yeah, they're gonna look weird. Oh, look, they already did. Why are my ears so long? I feel bad for her ears. They're so long, they make her look ugly. Why are you so rude to me? Huh? I was whispering. How come you heard that? So, I can hear everything now? Is this even a good thing? I should probably give the class a sudden exam. Sir, please don't. I haven't studied yet. What? I didn't even say anything out loud. I was just thinking it. I can hear people's thoughts? Um, sorry, no, maybe I heard wrong. Well, since I got caught, I'll just cancel it. Jess, I think there's something wrong with my ears. What's wrong? I think I can hear people's thoughts. If that's true, try listening to that new guy's thoughts. Okay. So, can you hear anything? Nope, nothing at all. Those ears attract a lot of attention. Yeah, I know. My ears are different than the others. No, not because of that. You can hear people's thoughts. How did you know that? I'm gonna help you hear the new boy's thoughts. Sir, where did the new student come from? I don't know, but you have to be friends with him. You want me to be friends with him? Yes, you're good at making friends. Plus, I want you to get some information from but him. But why? It doesn't matter, just do what I say. The school must be hiding a big problem. Hi, nice to meet you. So, you're new here, right? He won't understand you. He only talks in sign language. Yeah, I'm new here. If you want to get to know me, meet me after school. Wait, so you can talk? I know you can talk. You just pretend to be mute. I want to take you somewhere and you're going to have to listen to people's thoughts. What? No, I'm not going to listen to anyone's thoughts. Just trust me, you're not going to regret it. We have to break into this house. But this is our teacher's house. I don't want to. I could get expelled. Just do it for everyone's sake. What's wrong with this house anyway? I think there's people outside. We need to leave this place right now before we get caught. Run! No, if we run, we won't be able to hear the teacher's secrets. You listen then. I'm not trying to get caught. Just one more time, please. You won't regret it. Someone's definitely listening to our conversation. No, I can't. I need to go home. Mom, I'm home. I saw that test you hid under the bed. You got an F. You're so dumb. You don't have to shout. My ears hurt. You're lucky I don't ground you. You should be ashamed of yourself. Sis. What? Why were you outside the teacher's house listening to our conversation? Why were you there? Oh, um, he helps me with homework. Private lessons? Seriously? Isn't that weird? Nope, not at all. Why are your ears smaller than before? They are. Maybe because you're abusing them. I don't care if I lose my ears. It'll be better for me because then my friends will stop using me. Wait, wait. Wait, what do you mean? The more you use your ears, the more likely they'll disappear. That's exactly what I want. But if that happens, you'll never know what the new kid wants from you. Yeah, you're right. Did you get any information about that child? Yes, sir. Yesterday you took me to your house. Huh? To my house? No wonder I was hearing people outside. What were you guys doing? He told me to listen to your conversations, but I don't know why. Good. Keep reporting to me, okay? 
I will now announce the test results. Sarah, you got the highest grades in class. Sarah, my sister? New kid, you got the second highest. You have to go to your teacher's house again to get proof. What proof? That he's helping your sister cheat on the exam. The new kid deserves to be ranked number one in your class. Your teacher has really bad intentions. You look so beautiful today with that dress. I think the teacher's with his wife. Congratulations on being ranked number one in class today. Ranked number one? That means... Sarah, what are you doing here? What do you think? You're going out with the teacher? You should be ashamed of yourself. I have to find a new kid. Don't worry, I've already called the police and they've arrested the teacher. But how? You don't have any proof. Yesterday when you left, I installed a camera in his house, so I have all the proof that I need. You're a genius. Um, choose between the white bottle or the gold bottle. I choose the gold one. I wonder what power this one's gonna give me. I disappear when I hold my breath. Interesting. Mom, I- Honey, can you go to the shop for me and buy some vegetables? Amara, where did she go? Yes, she can't see me. <sighs> Finally, I can breathe again. What power did you get? I can disappear when I hold my breath. Oh, cool. Every time I sneeze, I fly. Why are you talking to Jason? He's so weird. Weird? What do you mean? He doesn't let anyone go to his house because he says his mom is fat. But his mom is fine. But Jason seems pretty normal to me. I have to prove it myself. Jason, I'm coming to your house later. No! What? Why? You don't want anything bad to happen, do you? Anything bad to happen? I have to disappear and enter Jason's home. Pretend to be poor or really be poor? You better pretend to be poor, Amara, so you know who's being sincere with you. Um, that's true, but how do I pretend to be poor? Just tell people that our company is bankrupt. Okay, starting from today, I'm going to pretend to be poor in front of all my friends. Hey, Amara, uh, why are you wearing that bag? Where are all your designer bags? Did you sell them? Yeah, because my family's company got bankrupt. I don't have any money. That's why I'm using this bag. Well, in that case, I don't want to be friends with you anymore. I was only friends with you because of the money. Amara, I heard that your family's company got bankrupt. Is it true? Yeah, my family's company got bankrupt, so I don't have any money now. Don't worry, Amara. I'm going to give you £5,000. £5,000? For me? Why? Isn't that like all your savings? It's okay, because you helped my family when we were poor, so in return, I'll give you my savings. Thank you, that's very nice of you. Look at Omar's family who's famous for being rich. They went bankrupt, you know? Huh, are you serious? That's crazy. That means we can't eat at fancy restaurants anymore. Class, in two days, there will be a study tour abroad. All students must participate in this activity, except Omar. Why can't I join, sir? I heard the news about your family, I assume you can't afford Who it. Who says I can't afford it? Amara, just give up, you're poor. Marissa's so annoying. She keeps saying that I'm poor, but she doesn't know that this whole time I've been lying about my family being bankrupt. You lied about it? You heard that? Please don't tell anyone. You're weird. Why do you even come to this school? Isn't it, like, expensive for you now? And why do you wear those branded clothes? Wasn't it me who bought them for you? Oh, you did not just say that. What? She slapped you? How dare she? Yeah, she slapped me. I was so shocked, I didn't even know what to do. That's it. Starting tomorrow, you don't have to pretend to be poor anymore. You have to show them how much you have. Hands or hair? Mom, what should I choose? Whatever you think is best for your soulmate to control. In that case, I'll choose hands. No, he can do strange things with his hands. Okay, I'll choose hair. Hey guys! Why is your hair like that? What do you mean? Hey, have a look. It's my stupid soulmate. He's controlling my hair today. Why would he pick this hairstyle? Now all my friends are making fun of me. Why isn't it coming off? Amara, take that ponytail out. You're not following the school rules. But miss, I tried to take it off, but it's not working. Seriously? Let me try. Ow! I guess I'll let you off, but don't let the principal see you. Principal's visiting our class today. What? What am I going to do? I'm breaking the rules. You should hide. Okay, don't tell anyone. And what are you doing here, young lady? I'm sorry, sir. I didn't do this hairstyle on purpose. My soulmate made me. Your hair is beautiful. I really like it. What? Your hair is beautiful. I like it. What?
Is he flirting with me? Why that face? Thanks for the compliment, sir. Please, you can call me Chris. You can call me Chris? What's that supposed to mean? Amara, you changed your hair? What? It's in two ponytails. <sighs> Why does my soulmate like such weird hairstyles? Okay, class, the principal's coming to visit us. Oh no, Amara, he's gonna see you. It's fine. Hello, everyone. There's something I want you all to do. Please take out anything you have in your hair, including hairbands. Just let loose of your hair. But I can't take my ponytails out, even if I tried to. Why is he doing this? Does he want to prove that I'm his soulmate? Amara, it's your turn. Amara, it's your turn. Sir, I can't take it out. Is it because of your soulmate? Yes. Okay, I see. Oh my gosh, he knows. What's going to happen now? Okay, everyone. Thank you for your time. He's just going to leave? That was weird. Why did he tell everyone to let their hair loose? If I tell you something, do you promise not to tell anyone? Yes, of course. What is it? I think the principal might be my soulmate. What? Isn't he like 40 or something? I don't know. I might be wrong. I really hope you are. Okay, class. Pack your stuff. It's time to go home. Not you, Amara. You need to go to the principal's office. He wants to talk to you. Good luck, bestie. Tell me what happens after, okay? Please don't be my soulmate. Please don't be my soulmate. Hey, you wanted to see me. There's someone I want you to meet. I can't believe it's you. What? That's my son. He's been controlling your hairstyles. Are you my soulmate? Is that why you asked the whole class to put their hair down? Yes, I was trying to help my son find out if it was really you. That makes so much more sense now. I thought you were my... I was your what? Nothing. Hey, I didn't catch your name. My name's Jack. Nice to meet you, Jack. You want to go for a walk? Let's go. Um, sweets aren't going to make me full. I'll choose the potatoes. I have a lot of time anyway. Amara, give me some. What? No, get your own. Please, I don't have much time left. Okay, but only this time. A bike or a car? Of course, the car. I still have a lot of time, so... iPhone. I'll just go for the mansion. If my time ends, I'll just ask my mom to give me some more years. What? I only have one day left? I don't want to die tomorrow. I have to ask my mom. Mom, give me more time. I only have one day left. Sorry, honey, I can't. I barely have enough left. Hi, guys. You can't be a student council president anymore. Why? Because you only have one day left. From tomorrow, I'm going to be the new president. If I press one of the options, I die. But who knows? Maybe it will give me more time. Your makeup looks cool today. Thanks. Should I make you some pancakes for breakfast? Not right now. I need to get to school. Hey, you're ready for the test. What test? The maths test that starts in an hour. <sighs> We never learn about this. The answer to question 25 is A. <laughs> I could get used to this. Hey, do you know where Emily is? Didn't you hear? She passed away. What do you mean she passed away? She took her own life. How do you know that? I was there. Get 100,000 every time someone hates me or every time someone loves me. Because so many people hate me, I'll choose hate. Morning, mom. I'm going to school. I don't care what you do. Did you forget that I hate you? That's fine. The more people hate me, the more money I get. So, see ya. Look at that new kid. She's poor. How come she goes to school? It's okay. Hate me as much as you want. I'm only getting richer. How dare you be rude to us? Do you even know who we are? I don't, and I don't care either. Amara, have you done your homework yet? I don't do homework, sir. You're very brave. Aren't you afraid of me kicking you out of the school? It's okay if you do anyway. I'll just go to another school that's more expensive than this one. What? Hey, just to let you know, I hate you too. You hate me? But how come I'm not getting any more money added? Exchange brain or exchange mouth with my soulmate? I should exchange brain because if I switch mouth, he might say something weird again. Mom, I'm going to school, okay? Be careful, honey. Wait, school is that way. Where are you going? Sorry, Mom, I forgot. How can I forget the direction to my own school? Hello, Amara. Hey, uh, do you know where school is? Let's go together. For real? I thought you memorized the way to school already. We've been going to the same school for seven years. Right. Let's just go together. Class, today we're having a sudden exam. Please make sure you answer all the questions. This is so easy. You're so quick to answer, Amara. You'll probably fail it as always. Congratulations, you got the highest grade in class. 
I'm going to enter you into a competition against the smartest kids in school. Really, sir? Why, Amara? She always gets bad grades. This is definitely because I exchanged brain with my soulmate. Amara, I heard you'll be competing against the smartest kids in school. Did you not know that? The competition is about to start. I have to go. Bye. Her ranking? What does this mean? It's your family rank, honey. Rank 3 means ordinary family and rank 2 means famous family. What about rank 1, mom? You don't need to know because it's impossible for anyone to get that rank. I'm going to try to get rank 1 for our family. <laughs> yeah. Looks like she thinks I'm joking. I'm going to prove it. I got rank 2, meaning my family's famous. Same. Wow, congrats guys. You've got your family ranks. You haven't gotten yours, Amara? Not yet. Is that normal? Oh my gosh, it's definitely not normal. Maybe your family doesn't have one. Not possible. My family's famous like yours. I'm so miserable. What's wrong? Why are you crying? Can't you see? Oh my gosh, why isn't your rank appearing? Is there an error in the system? No, I don't have a family. That's why it's not appearing. I'm so sorry, Gemma. Okay, class, please get in groups according to your rankings. But sir, I don't have a ranking. Then you can sit with Gemma because she has no rank either. This is so unfair. Why isn't it appearing? Don't worry, Amara. You'll get yours soon. Yeah, but why is it taking so long? Apparently, only one family gets rank number one. And if they do, they get appreciated whatever they yeah, get. Yeah, it doesn't seem like I'm going to get my ranking anytime soon. Here, eat this piece of chocolate. It should help you get rank number one in the next hour. Okay, I have nothing to lose. Class, I have good news. What is it, sir? Soon, the person who got rank one will be revealed. Oh my gosh, imagine that chocolate helped me get rank one. I'm so jealous of whoever gets rank one. Guys, I'm the one who will get rank one, and I'm going to prove it. Three, two, one. Please be at least one. I've never gotten any wishes before. Uh, what is that? Mom, what does this mean? Oh, I didn't expect you to be one of the chosen ones. The chosen ones? The government chooses three people who get unlimited wishes. I have unlimited wishes? Yeah, you do. <sighs> There's no way she got unlimited wishes. You're so lucky. I know. Do you think if we kill her, we get all her wishes? No, I don't think that's how it works. I wish they both slip on a banana. Ouch! You may think you're important because you have unlimited wishes, but deep down, you're just a nerd like you've always been. I wish you were mute for the whole day. Mmm! Mmm! Amara, what's the answer to question B? I wish I knew the answer to question B. It's 46. Correct. Hey, you! Ah, uh, you can talk again. You're so gonna regret doing that to me. Morning, Mom. Where did your wishes go? Morning, Mom. Where did your wishes go? What do you mean? Here, take a look. What? My unlimited wishes, they're gone! But how? Emma. What? I don't have time to talk, I need to go to school. Oh my gosh, you have unlimited wishes, how did you get them? You're like so cool. Hey you! Hey, did you know I woke up and found out I have unlimited wishes? Give them back. I don't know what you're talking about. I said give them back! Ouch! Miss, she's hurting me! Amara, take your hands off She her. stole my unlimited wishes! There's no such thing as stealing unlimited wishes. Go to the principal's office. Your behavior is disappointing. It's Emma, she stole my unlimited wishes. What did you expect me to do? Wait, she did what? Yeah, I had unlimited wishes last night, and when I woke up this morning, they were gone. She stole them? Wait, you believe me? Her dad works with the government, so anything could be possible. Hey, Amara, good to see you back. Thank you, you too. Hey mom, did you get a new haircut? You look so much younger now. Aw, thanks. Mommy, I really want that ice cream. Sorry honey, I didn't bring any change with me. Hey, no worries, I can get it for her. Are you sure? Yeah, of course. Well, thank you very much, you're so kind. Hey, watch it. <gasps> I'm so sorry, I wasn't looking. Hey, can I please have another cup of coffee? I accidentally spilt mine. Sorry, I can't serve you. You have more than 20 downvotes. What? It was an accident. Get out, otherwise I'll call the police. What's happening? Amara, you're all over the news. What? Why? You have to take a look at this. Girls, today you will choose your husband, who you will slay to. This is ridiculous. Hey, so who are you choosing? None. I'm not letting any man control me. Stop being silly. Everyone has to choose. I already know who I'm picking. Good for you. But this whole thing is wrong and no one's saying anything about it. Hey, pick me. No. 
I hope the girl that chooses me has a nice body and long hair. Is that all you care about? No, but it's what I prefer. Sis, have you picked? I'm so scared for my day to come. I don't want to pick. Then don't. No one can force you to do anything. I wish that's how things work, but don't. I've had enough of this. Time to change history. No one. I don't want to pick anyone. I'm so tired of being single. Dad, can I go to an all-boys school? An all-boys school? I mean, yeah, that's what you really want. I already chose it. I'm so excited. Anyways, I'll see you later. I need to go to my new school. Wait, before you go, you must know that boys only school. It doesn't matter. I already chose it. Bye. Wait, it's important. I can't wait to get to school. Everyone's definitely going to be surprised because I'm the only girl there. And I can finally get myself a new boyfriend. Guys, look. Why is there a girl wearing our school uniform? For God's sake, Dave. It's still morning. Don't worry about it. But really, wow, she's so beautiful. Why does the toilet smell like pee? Because there's no girls here, so we can pee freely. Wait, what? Are you for real? No, I'm just joking. Can I have your number? I I'm just gonna go. Today we're gonna learn how to cook, so you can be the dream husband in the future. Yes, cooking class. This is one of my favorite classes in school. But why do all guys look so pale? Please choose your own group. One group consists of two people learn how to cook so you can be the dream husband in the future yes cooking class this is one of my favorite classes in school but why do all guys look so pale please choose your own group one group consists of two people why are you all looking at me like that please be in my group i can't cook leave her alone she's gonna pick me don't listen to them come the seat next to me is free whoa relax instead of fighting over me i can just teach you all how to cook it's very easy why is there a girl in this class? Who allowed her in the school? Throw her out now. Why should we throw her out? She's better at teaching us how to cook than you are. Just get rid of her now. Ugh, I hate teenage girls. Are you sure you want to kick me out of the school? That would be a very bad idea. And why do you say that? Because I... Are you sure you want to kick me out of the school? That would be a very bad idea. And why do you say that? Because I chose to be in an all-boys school. I'm sure if you kick me out, you'll get in trouble. You chose? What do you mean by that? Yeah, it was one of my options. That's weird. Usually people don't get to pick. Well, anyway, I think you're lying, so I'm going to have to report you to the principal. But miss, I don't think that's necessary. Yes, it is. For now, I'm sending you home until the principal makes a decision. But miss, don't send her home. We need her here. Be quiet. Pack your stuff. You're leaving. Hey, Dad. You're home early. How was your first day of school? I got sent home. What? Why? Because apparently I'm not allowed to be in an all-boys school because I'm a girl. Well, I tried telling you, but you didn't listen. Boys' schools usually don't accept girls, so I don't even know how you go it as an option. Well, maybe I got it as an option because they need me there. I was able to help them today, so maybe I'll be a good addition to the school. True. Well, what's going to happen now? The principal will make a decision whether I get to stay or switch school by tomorrow. Anyway, I'm going to go to my room. I have to study. Okay, good luck, honey. The principal wants to see you. Okay. You wanted to see me, sir? Yes, I'm very surprised to see a girl in the school. How did you get here? Well, one of my options was to go to an all-boys school. I'm really sorry, but I don't think we can keep you here. It wouldn't be appropriate, as you're the only girl here. Plus, all our students here have top grades. I don't think any girls can beat their grades, because, you know, boys are smart. Wait, really? Is that the reason you don't want to keep me here? Yes, the only way would be to test you and see if you get good scores on the exam. In order to be a student here, you have to get 100 out of 100. So, do you think you can do it? Okay, I'll do it. Shortly, I'll prepare your exam paper. Don't be upset if you can't do it. Oh, I can. Trust me. I'm going to prove to you that girls can be smart too. We're not just here to look pretty. Hey, can I ask you something? Yes. Did you have to do an exam before starting in the school? Yes. And did you have to get 100 out of 100? What? No, I only had to get 50 out of 100. So the principal did this on purpose because he thinks I can't get a good score. All right, thank you. I'm going to prove him wrong. I'm so ready for this exam. I've been studying all night. Here's your exam. You have one hour. I'll be standing here to make sure you don't cheat. Oh, don't worry, sir. I don't need to cheat. This is going to be very easy for me. Here's your exam. You have one hour. I'll be standing here to make sure you don't cheat. Oh, don't worry, sir. I don't need to cheat. This is going to be very easy for me. You have two minutes left. Done. Are you sure you don't want to read over your answer? I already did. When do I know the result? In about two hours. Okay, can I go to class now? Go ahead, I'll call you when the results are in. Psst. Hey Amara, how's your exam? 
It was okay. Can you imagine the principal wants me to get 100 out of 100 in order to stay in the school? What? That's insane. It's also impossible to get 100 out of 100. No one ever knows the answer to everything. Well, I was up all night studying yesterday, so I hope I got all the questions right. Hey, stop talking and focus on the lesson. Sorry, miss. Amara, the principal wants to see you about your results. Okay. Come on in. I'm pretty surprised with your school. I'm not going to lie. I didn't think you could do it. Because usually girls aren't smart. What does that mean? You broke the school record with the highest grade. <laughs> so, does that mean I'm a student here now? Nope, not yet. What do you mean? That was the deal. I have to test you at PE. As you know, boys are usually better at sports. And if you want to be a student here, you can't embarrass us. We often compete against other schools. And what sport do you want me to play? Basketball. Considering your height, I'm not sure you can do it. It's not too late to quit and switch schools. No, know? I want to do it. Okay, practice starts at 5 p.m. today. Don't be late. Okay, sir. Okay, everyone. I want you to try and score as many goals as you can. Why can't I get any in? Hey, let me help you. What's your name? Chris, and you? Amara. Okay, focus on what I'm doing. Since you're a beginner, you have to stay not far away from the goal. Focus on the little box right there. Once you hit it, just like this, the ball should go straight through. Hey, you have a try. See, I knew you could do it. Hey, Chris, get back to your team. Don't help her. I have to go. I'll see you later. But hey, don't give up. You're doing good. Amara, come here. Yes, sir. I want you to score 20 goals without any misses. If you can't do it, you can't be a student. 20 goals without missing? Not even once? Not even once. Okay, get ready. The test starts in 3, 2, 1. What? I can't wear that. I'm used to going to school. Yeah, I'm definitely getting sent home for this. Revenge time. Amara, what are you wearing? I know, my soulmate made me. You better hope none of the teachers sees you, otherwise you'll get a detention. They're definitely going to see me. Excuse me, young lady, where's your school uniform? Miss, my soulmate made me wear this. I don't care, go home and change. I can't. My teacher just sent me home and told me to change to a school uniform. I can't go to school in this, especially now that she's told me to change. You deserve it. Amara, didn't I tell you to change? That's it. Two out of ten from after school. Sorry I'm late, miss. First a swimsuit and now a Barbie costume? I'm not going to embarrass him today. Great. I'm so going to get a detention for this. Amara, why aren't you wearing the school uniform? Because my soulmate chose for me to wear this. You know when the teacher sees you, she's going to give you a detention, right? Yeah, I know. Amara, come here. Yes, miss? You're not wearing a school uniform, why? Because my soulmate chose for me to wear this. Is that your excuse, your soulmate? Look, if you're going to give me a detention, just do it already. Just because you said that, you're getting a two-hour detention. Payback time. You really think I'm going to wear a bikini to school? Not happening. <laughs> your soulmate really made you wear a wedding dress to school. Yeah, he's horrible. Wait. Why am I feeling kind of sick? Are you going to buy that? I don't know. I'm kind of running low on money. Just ask your soulmate for some. Yeah, you're right. I'm just going to buy it. No way I'm sending him that. My soulmate sent me 100000 Oh, you're lucky. I'm so happy for you. Stop asking me for money. £5,000. Who the hell does he think he is? I want a new soulmate. He always asks me for money but never sends any. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh, mine sent me more. Gotta go. One million? He locked it? Why would he lock it? Good morning, honey. Morning, mum. Huh? 200%? Why is this percentage thing above my head? Oh, that's the level of love someone feels for you. Wow, so your love for me is 200%? That's right, honey. <sighs> Hey, Amara. Hey. Let's walk to class together. 10%? This whole time you said you love me like a sister. Turns out you were just lying. What? What are you talking about? There's no point pretending anymore. You're just fake. I thought she was my best friend. I can't believe she was pretending this whole time. Hey, babe. Hey. Are you okay? Yeah, your love level for me is at 100%, right? Yeah, of course it is. If you don't like me, why are you dating me? We're over. Mom, home! My daughter's so stupid, you can easily lie to her. What did you lie about? I told her it was a love percentage, but it's actually a hate percentage. 
My daughter's so dumb, you can easily lie to her. What did you lie about? I told her it was a love percentage, but it's actually a hate percentage. Mom! Honey, what are you doing here? I thought you were at You school. lied to me. Now because of you, I've lost all my friends at school and I broke up with my boyfriend. Oh, honey, I'm so sorry. No, no, you're not. Why do you hate me so much? Because you're a spoiled little brat. What kind of a mother hates her own child? I'm not your real mom. What? Your dad cheated on me and your real mom wasn't ready to raise you. So your dad left you here with me. He's always traveling for work and I've had to raise you all on my own. Is that why you hate me? I hate you because I haven't been able to live my life how I was supposed to. I lost my job because I had to take care of you. Well, I'm sorry I was such a headache to you. Hey. What do you want? I'm sorry for what I said yesterday. You called me fake. I know, but it was all a misunderstanding. Will you forgive me? Please be a long name. Please be a long name. Only three letters? I have to be careful. I can't mess this up. If I find out my soulmate's name before we meet, he could die. Don't ask questions. Okay, it can't be that hard. Hey Amara, did you do the homework? No, did you? It's only been 20 minutes and I've already messed up. How many letters does your soulmate have? He only has three letters and I've already guessed one. You have to be careful. You don't want to kill him before you even meet I him. I know. Okay, I just have to be careful this time. Hey Amara. Hey. What do you think about my new hat? Well... To be honest, it's ugly. Amara, everyone's saying you kissed my boyfriend at that party on Saturday. Is it true? Yes. And I thought we were best friends. Wait! I hope the next task will be easier than the last one. Hey, what happened between you and Liv? She seemed very angry after your conversation. Oh, you can't talk? Well, I hope you sort things out. I have to go. Bye! Watch out! Ouch! What did you do that for? Sorry, it was an accident. Well, be careful next time. You just made me lose a task. Relax, it's just one task. No, my soulmate only has three letters in his name, and I've already failed the task. Well, now two because of you. Oh, sorry, I didn't know. If I fail another task, my soulmate dies, and I can't be the reason behind my soulmate's death. Well, hopefully you'll get easier tasks. Hopefully. Please be something easy. For five minutes? Isn't that like humanly impossible? Why are you shouting? I'm trying to study. Who are you? I'm Max. Who are you?